What is going on guys? Welcome to today's episode where we are going grocery shopping. I am completely out of food, basically. And it has essentially been a weekend of eating not a whole lot, which has uh, affected my weight. What I weigh like 256 or 257, something like that this morning, which is five pounds lower than my usual um, that's where i ended on what wednesday morning last week so it just goes to show you like how important food is how important what you eat is and eating often is i mean yeah i could keep eating like this you know pretty relaxed and stay at about 255 or something, but that is not the goal that we're going for. We're trying to build muscle, we're trying to be in a surplus, we're trying to grow, so yeah, you need to eat and you need to eat often. That's just the way this works and that's pretty much what I have proven by being off diet basically Thursday, Friday. Saturday I was a little closer to being on Sunday, I was a little closer to being on, but it's still not, it was not perfect. It was not 100%. I didn't get all my meals in. Um, yesterday, we were running around all day with the Chicago Marathon going on, which went really well for Laura. She ran it in 313.43, which I believe is like 7 minute 24 second miles which is a new PR for her. So that's good, that's a good thing. All of her training paid off. Uh, training with her new coach paid off. Shout out to DW Running for his great programming. Pretty much spent all day yesterday out doing that, but I did eat, let's see, I ate at 6 a.m., I ate at 9 a.m., oh, I ate at noon. I ate two MRE bars at noon. And then uh, after that, let me give you guys some light. Yeah, and then after that, that was pretty much it until about 5.30 to 6 p.m. or so, because yeah, I ate those, then I went and lifted at about two or three, which went really well, but then uh, went home, took a shower, got cleaned up, and we went out to dinner last night at this restaurant, Daisy's, which is, um, it's a really good restaurant, but it's not, it's more like a pasta and vegetable place. Um, they do always have like, two protein dishes um, so yeah it was basically a, a carb fest with a little bit of meat at the end of our meal but yeah that place is great so anyways I'm out of food had two meals this morning first meal being my usual MRE light protein shake and a banana and then um, at 9 a.m. I had some spinach with five ounces of flank steak and a cup of rice but now I'm out of food. So we are here at the grocery store. We are going to completely restock on everything. So I want to just give you guys a uh, an idea what I get, what I pick out, so you can see what I do. I mean, this is gonna be, we're gonna get about five days worth of food. Whatever that ends up costing, you guys will know then what I spend on about five days worth of food. So that is what's up, let's get going because I got to eat at noon.
So that was our trip to the grocery store. In total, we spent $136.85. This will last me about five days. There's a few things that are gonna last a little bit longer. The cranberry juice will last a little bit longer. The rice, possibly a little longer. But for the most part, that's gonna be what it is. So it is about what it costs for five days of groceries, not even a week's worth. That's what's up. And that's what I wanted to show you guys today. Now all I need to do is start cooking because I need to get ready for my noon meal and then I'm gonna go work out, train some people tonight. So that's all that I've got for you today. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thanks for your support. Remember, nobody cares, train harder, and I will see you all tomorrow.